Hello and welcome everyone to Diablo 4. Four. Um, I'm very excited to play this game um, because I've never ever played even a second of a Diablo game. I barely watched maybe five minutes of Diablo gameplay of any Diablo game, so I have pretty much no clue of what's going on, and uh, that's that's exciting to me. But also a little bit intimidating because uh, I know that there are one or two people in this world who play a bunch of Diablo and um, I will have no clue what I'm doing. So uh, that'll, that'll be interesting, but uh, exciting nonetheless. And I'm glad that you are here to join me on this little adventure and see how it goes. Maybe it'll go terrible. Maybe it will go well. We'll see. But um, I'm pretty much ready to go to hell with with coffee and controller and uh, I think that's all I need as far as I know so uh, let's let's jump into the game right away don't waste any time connect to the Diablo services I guess in a queue. I know. Oh boy. Run! All right. Hopefully, what this is, what's going on? But just keep running. Are you out of your mind? He's not going to make it. Blessed Akarat, my eternal light protects me. My divine haste. Hey, look at me! All the gold we want is right there. No, I... I just came here for knowledge. They're coming! I know. Get over here! Now, breach the seal. Get us through that door! I think they're already coming, buddy. Way open. Blood show. This doesn't make any sense. Blood. Blood. Blood is the key. B blood is the key. What? I need two of you. No, go. I'll hold them. Go. It says the, the blood of the willing goes. Ugh. You gotta be kidding me! I love the blood <sighs> ritual is the best thing you do on a Friday morning, but here we are. Ah, it worked! We have to help him! He's dead already. patch buddy kind of looked like Bronn from Game of Thrones maybe it was the actor I'm actually not sure look very simple big. oh well cheer up gold splits better three ways instead of four 
must be hidden here somewhere. Read this. But by three they come, by three thy way opens, by the blood of them. Willing. Hail. Hail the cre the creator. Ha! Oh. Hail the daughter of Oh no. No, no, no. What about the coin? What's it say? This is forbidden. This is a summoning. I cannot speak. Don't this lie to me! We came here for treasure. What is this place? I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's a temple. I mean, usually the places oh, that you open with a blood sacrifice it. are bad places. Uh oh. Big ominous voice. Just yeeted that guy. Uh oh. Uh oh. And blood is the key. Ow! It's eye patch, bro. Oh, he probably set it up so to find someone to do the ritual that they want to do. See, I have no clue of the the lore or anything, so feel free to let me know about it. And what happened in the previous games? I don't know how story <laughs> intense I these are. Uh oh. 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 Uh the Uh oh. We call thee home. That's a new guy. I know who that is. You guys probably recognize him. Come. Ah! Listen, I cannot. The eternal life protects me. The divine wisdom guides me. Open eyes. your eyes. Eternal life protects me. Eternal life protects me. Eternal life protects me. Eternal life protects me. Eternal there is no light here. Yeah. You came to the darkness for knowledge. <sighs> yes. And all the knowledge you seek is here. Surrender. Speak the words. Call her home. Her. Also, I have not watched any of the trailers or anything. I know nothing about you. By three, they come. By three, thy way opens. By the blood of the willing, we call thee home.
Sick mother. Save us. Okay, she got a nice little flash cape. Her name is Lilith. I heard the name of four bombs. That's about all I know. That was a pretty cool uh, cinematic, I have to say. Um, that was pretty awesome. I love his skin tag, yeah. I mean, maybe needs a pedicure, to be honest, but then again, if you've been... I don't know if she was banished or whatever happened. Like, I, I'm... Welcome, Renee's, by the way. I'm not sure if uh, uh, you heard me mention before. I know nothing about the Diablo games or what's going on in these games. I haven't played a single second before. I haven't... I've never watched anyone play Diablo either, so this is all... Just a big question mark for me. But that opening cutscene was pretty cool. So, I'll just roll with that. So, I guess we select our uh, class here. So, we have the Barbarian. We have the Necromancer. The Sorcerer. The Rogue. The Rogue. And the Druid. Now, I also don't know what I want to pick. So, let's go through the overview. Uh, powerful warriors who rely on brute force to subdue their enemies. Barbarians are able to swap between an array of powerful weapons during combat, ensuring that they are prepared for any situation. Berserking. I played a little of two and played through three. Uh, I'm kind of middling on experience myself. Yeah, like, I, it was always one of those game series that obviously was ever present, it felt. A lot of people big fans of it. Uh, I just never got around playing any of those. Um, and uh, I don't know, it just it also never came across my my like Twitch and YouTube circles much, so I never really ended up watching anything. Um, and even now I didn't didn't watch any of the trailers or uh, any of that. I just heard people being excited and that kind of got me excited. So I was like, I mean, might as well try out a Diablo. So, here I am. Berserking! Uh, Challenging your inner rage to enter and maintain the berserking state. Increased damage and movement speed. Well, that's very, uh, very D&D. Bleed, use slashing uh, weapons to cause enemies to bleed, dealing damage to them over time. Walking arsenal, become a walking arsenal, gaining damage and other bonuses for using various weapons in combat and unbridling rage the pinnacle of aggression you have an increased fury cost to use skills and exchange your skills are dramatically more powerful okay and we have the necromancer i'm all i always like a good necromancer Likely play it eventually, but I've had Street Fighter 6 and then Final Fantasy 16 is out next week. Yeah, like, uh, Final Fantasy 16 kind of snuck, snuck up on me. Um, I just always had like, oh yeah, there will, there will be another Final Fantasy. And then last week, everyone, I think it was last week where I realized like, oh, it was act it's actually coming out in a couple of weeks. <laughs> this is not years in the future. It's, it's, it's about here. <laughs> so... Oh, I don't, I don't know if I will play Final Fantasy XVI. Um, since, uh, so far, really, my... What was it? What, which Final Fantasy? I think it was eight. The one with Squall. That one that nobody liked. Except for patient. So, <laughs> I really enjoyed that one, to be honest. But other than that, I never really played a uh, Final Fantasy game in full. Uh, Necromancer. The ne enigmatic Necromancer are custodians of the balance between life and death. They can raise powerful undead armies to fight for them, while also wielding the powerful magics of bone, shadow, and blood. Summon a host of undead minions to do your bidding, including skeletal warriors, skeletal mages, and the golem. Bone. Use the power of bone magic. So we can. Uh, to physically assail the, uh, enemies. Bone skills often gain increased power when you have large amount of essence. Darkness. Wear down enemies over time. Darkness skills utilize crowd control elements so that enemies are kept at bay while they die in 
a slow, painful death. Blood. Siphon the life from enemies with blood magic, which has defensive benefits while becoming more powerful as you increase your maximum life. The demo is worth a shot at at least this one is quite different gameplay wise okay uh, i might yeah I, I might try it out i might try out the demo at, at the very least and we have the sorcerer mass of the elements sorcerers inflict cold fire and lightning damage to subdue their enemies frost frost skill skills chill Enemies, reducing their movement speed, chilling enemies will eventually freeze them, causing them to be unable to act. Pyromancy. Pyromancy skills focus on dealing fire damage. These skills deal a high amount of damage and cause enemies to burn for additional damage over time. Shock skills use lightning to defeat enemies. These skills have many ways to reduce cooldowns of benefit, especially while well when critically striking. Okay. Rogue. The Cunning Rogue uses whatever tools are available to get the job done. Rogues are both agile and resourceful, able to fight enemies at range with bows or up close with daggers. They are also able to imbue their ma weapons with vari mag various magics. Marksmen. Kite enemies at a distance using bows and arrows. Marksmen benefit from critical striking, critically striking enemies and by causing them to become vulnerable. Imbuements. Imbue weapons with poison, cold, or shadow energies. These imbuements give attacks special properties, but they damage enemies. Lay traps on the ground, which can trigger various effects. These effects range from damaging targets, poisoning them, slowing them, and much more. And last but not least, we have the Druid. Flexible and resilient, druids harness the power of nature to protect life. Druids can shapeshift between the cunning werewolf and the powerful werebear to fight uh, their enemies. Additionally, those who prefer spellcasting can unleash earth and storm magic from a distance. Werewolves. Werewolves are ferocious and agile. They benefit greatly from increasing their attack speed and critically striking enemies. The Werebear is a powerful force on the battlefield, dealing damage in large areas while also being notorious difficult to take down. Storm. Call upon Storm from the X-Men to rain lightning upon your enemies or blow them away with powerful gusts of wind. Earth. Earth magic. Focus on limiting enemy movement with crowd control effect. They also benefit when used against enemies who are in such a state. <clears throat> okay, interesting. I mean, since I have no clue which is most suitable to my playstyle, because I've, again, I've never played these. Um, um, and I think. Like I'll, it'll be a mix of me playing mostly alone, and then um, I did talk to Hypatia before to play some co-op, so um, I need something that I can... Uh, I, I hope that... Uh, uh, I've heard sorcerers are pretty powerful, but never seen anyone play them yet. Okay, that, that that's good info. So I was leaning between... Necromancer, which seems kind of like, I feel like a lot of people play Necromancer. I've, I've seen a bunch of people talk about Necromancers um, without knowing what's going on, but I'm just like, oh, here's my Necromancer, hot lady. Um, which, fair enough. Like, I'm leaning towards that as well. Uh, but I also, I'm also kind of curious about Barbarian. Um, I, read, I read one thing that Druids are kind of difficult the beginning yeah everyone likes to throw the bone around yeah i mean who doesn't love a good bone magic right when fighting the evil overlord lady called lilith so so i think for me com completely I, I i don't think i will play a rogue that much i feel in my bone um Sorcerer. Sorcerer would be interesting. I do like to do a little bit of magic. That is kind of fun. Um, and as someone who has no clue what he's doing, having something that is pretty powerful might actually come in handy. So that is a good advice. 
that's also kind of like the 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 good the good sister of uh to the necromancer i have the saucer just give me two shoes let's let's do saucer i mean i can always create a new character if i don't like it right as far as i know Ah, let's go with a saucer lady I turn them around? No. And I'll turn them around. We will definitely customize, but I was kind of checking some presets. For once I actually like some some of these presets. Usually it's like the presets are usually like, I don't know. Oh, let's stop with this and go from there. Who knows where we end up. These variations. We, we could be necromancer wide. Like, that at least gives us a little bit of necromancy. Just being pale as a bone. Without bone magic. Let's get like an elemental color in here. Let's get like green eyes that, that feels very sorcerer, right? Hair. Always the most important thing, okay? No hair. That that might be a choice for barbarian or necromancer. Okay. Hmm. I mean, not a ton of options, but maybe maybe going with this kind of like a because in my mind, sources are always a little bit hoity-toity. So, yeah, some stronger eyebrows. We have like multi colors. That's that's interesting. Black and teal. That looks kind of like we're molding. I don't know if we want moldy hair. Doesn't look bad, but I don't know if moldy hair is really what I'm going. I think the colors are a little off from what I want them to be. I actually don't like that hair. I think I want a different hair. Let's go with this. Let's... Hey, you know what? Maybe we go like fire mage. Like a fiery redhead mage. Why not? Okay. I like that. That works. Be all tatted up. With this and tattoo. Okay. Definitely something red, since that is our theme here. I'm thinking of a theme on the fly. This could be good. Or I also like this, because this is kind of like a dark tattoo color, but it has like a little bit of a shimmering red in there. I think I like this. <laughs> she looks like a lady who makes questionable choices you approve. Right? I think that's perfect for like a Diablo sorceress. And also, I feel like she looks like she... Uh, you definitely can can throw a fireball or two. And like with armor, looks pretty badass. Looks also badass without armor, don't get me wrong. Uh, I'm maybe not too hardcore the first time I play it. Uh, name required. 
Okay, now I gotta come up with a name. Always the, the toughest part, right? What's what's a good name for a fiery sorceress? <clears throat> we could just do like a battle for uh, for name rights, also call her Lilith. Like, eh, let's see who survives. But, man, like, I can't think of a name right now. This. Oh, we have, like, suggestions. That's good. Amber? Amber's interesting. I like it. I like it. Um, he's a little bit too much like an Etsy store owner. But... Obviously, the spelling here is important. Um, why not? Let's do Amber. I don't have a better idea, so it is good. Go with Amber. Again, who knows? Maybe I'll try out different characters anyway. Okay, uh, more guidance. I need all the guidance that I need. Burn it down. You got me there. Do love a good pun. That's good. That's great. Burn a bat. See, I'm. I, I don't even have uh, one copy in me, so I do appreciate the the support. Burn it out of this. Okay, I need all the guidance. Then, uh. Selective code. This may be changed at any time from the character selection screen or from the world tier status. In Kyovishat, uh, players must be in the same world tier to form a party. Um, adventure. Recommend for players who are new to Diablo or want a light challenge. Enemies are easy to defeat. I mean, I don't know. Like, I, I mean, I, I feel like adventure would be the thing, but... Recommended for Diablo veterans who want to more of a challenge. Enemies are more challenging. Monsters give 20% increased experience. Monsters drop 50% more. I mean, I don't know. Let's let's go. Let's do veteran. Like, I mean, what do I have to lose? <laughs> and if I suck, I can always be like, oh, the, the sorcerer in, in Diablo 4 just sucks. Like, it's really wow. Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was. And Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall. I think you can change this. Yeah, yeah, I can. I think it said, said that in the, the thing that I can change it in the menu. Always very welcoming to put creepy statues in the woods. She looks pretty badass. I'm I'm uh, content with my character creation.
favorite fire mage. Make yourself some fire, lady. <laughs> Can't be that cold. Love that little smear that she has. Gross. Okay, we're in the game. I should find better shelter before That's how I, I freeze. Hey, nerd. How do you know? How, I think I think it's a little loud overall, right? Let me just adjust the thing right now. Not a chance yet. So uh, let's just think, usually let's put down the music a little bit. Put down the effects a little bit. Hello. 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 Something like that, maybe. Let's go with that. Let me know how the how the sound sounds. If it's sounding. If, if it's a sound sound. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's how I dash. Okay. More gold, we're already rich. We broke the game. Oh, oh. oh we we already are undefeated. There must be like a hidden super powerful item here, right? That's how these types of games work. That you just look around and then you find like find like one of the most powerful items in the game, like right in the game. storm has passed. Okay. Oh. We just... We just stomp on these carcasses. Uh oh Okay, I guess with left... With the left button I can heal? Like that four... But a four thing above my what I assume is my health. Oh. I already got so much gold. But that person. That's like the sword of the ancient ancients or something. One bat. Oh. Also hold it. Just kick some stone and gold comes out of it. Pretty neat. Try that in real life. I'm a low on life. Like 80% full of life. At least in the game. But 
I was correct with my assumption about the healing. That just shows that I'm a pro gamer and that it was the right choice to pick uh, the veteran. Give me like a powerful thing. Another abandoned Ask. town. Demons everywhere. Oh. Fangs in the dark. Gah! He bit me. Who bit you? Careful. He's a wild one. Hello. <clears throat> I'm here to bite you, uh, to talk to you. Osman. Uh, what's going on here? What's it to you? Oswin, hush! I'm sorry, Wanderer. You've come at a difficult time. This madman just stumbled into town and started causing trouble. Demons spilling from the ruins. Kill us all. Kill us all. Ruins? What is he talking about? Yeah. Come, I'll explain. There is evil staring in the ruins to the north. That poor monk back there must have gone inside. Even a holy man like him was driven mad by whatever he saw. Isabel weapons. Guess that's a traitor. Healer. Let's talk to Vanny first. Vanny, some shelter. I'm sorry, it's a bit cramped. It's still better than a cave. Uh, what can you tell me about the people here? Alenta went a bit deaf last winter. You might need to speak up around her. What is this place? Uh. Nothing special about our little town, but it's home. Okay. What about that monk guy that you mentioned? We'll do what we can for him. Might have to keep him in the shed for now, though. He tried to bite off Osman's fingers. Gross. Give him something to eat, then. It's not safe here. Could you protect us from whatever is out there? We have nowhere else to turn. There is evil lurking in those ruins. I will drag it into the light of day. Truly? Oh, thank you. Ooh, we got, oh, okay. Uh, press things for skill. Abilities. Ooh, there we go. We got spark. Launch a bolt of lightning that shocks uh, an enemy four times, doing two damage each hit. Throw a bolt of frost at an enemy, dealing 10 damage and chilling them. Firebolt. Obviously firebolt. But I will check the other one out. Just arc Lash. Leashing arcing lightning that deals 13 damage to enemies. Obviously we knew firebolt. Obviously. Uh, let's assign that one. Oh, we already... Oh, it's already at A. Wait, does, does it cost... Mana? Doesn't say that, so I think it's just like my normal attack now. Okay. Okay, let's talk to the other people. The fire's looking good, but I should watch it a little longer to make sure it doesn't go out. Or a warm heart. There are still things to be grateful for in this world. Fire's looking okay. good. But if Devmir's taking up all the space by the fire, just give him a shove. <laughs> I have remedies if you're injured. Oh, he just healed me for free. That's good. 
What's I thought that? he might be a healer. Did you say something? Like that you pay, like a healer mer merchant. Gotta cool. protect yourself out there. Okay, so currently we have the hide tunic, some hide pants, some hide boots, but an apprentice wand and a relic skull. Got the same things. And the fiendish folio. Don't know what that does. We would. I could buy it, but I don't know if that's worth it. That's good to know. Let's look. Do we have a map? We do have a map. Okay, so that is where our uh, quest leads us. Blacko! For some reason, it's not playing the sound. Why it's not playing the... Just... You really are oh, there we go. With Who's the me? maid? If I didn't know better, I'd think you had feelings <clears throat> for me. No, I'm not on PC. Like, my PC can barely handle a potato these days. So, oh, I pressed something accidentally. But thank you for the reset, Blacko. You are here for mommy. Uh, yeah, we already uh, saw Lilith, but uh, Bernadette, as Renee's uh, christened this character, will burn her ass. Your eye looks so different. Interesting. So you, um, I, I uh, uh, saw you play some Diablo. Are you a Diablo expert? Because I have no clue of Diablo. I mentioned it earlier. Never played any Diablo game for even a second. So these are my first steps. And um, I have no clue about the world, about the characters, about anything. Um, why there is like a like a like a hot demon lady with like a flash curtain. Um, or any of that. And, uh, just, uh, I am playing on, uh, Xbox. Here is Sexbox. There we go. There we go. Now we got some fire going on with our fire mage. Also, let me know how the, the sound balances. I'm not sure if the effects might be a little... They feel a little loud, right? Like, they, they feel loud. Me, at least. Even more for you, it feels too loud for me. On with that, this felt a little bit too loud. So this one seems to be a mix of the games I'm used to play, like uh, Path of Exile and such, and the classic MMO. You have sort of rotation of abilities use. So you haven't played the previous uh, Diablos either. Interesting. Of course, because I'm a pro pro gamer, I uh, chose the veteran difficulty because, I mean, how hard, how hard can a Diablo game be, right? It's kind of looking. I uh, want to look around in this area first. I played the special successor, successor and skipped three. I see. Yeah, I never got around playing any of these, so it's interesting diving in. I, I really enjoyed that intro cinematic. That one was really cool. I had no clue what was going on, but it looked great. So, can we talk to Osman again? Watch out, eh? He's a biter. I wanted to talk to that monk. Yeah, I wonder if I could turn it off, actually, because I don't plan on doing that. Good point. Um, option? I mean, I haven't really looked at the gameplay. Perks. Trip compare. Hot configuration. It's fine. Display, monster helper, highlights. Doesn't seem to be anything here, right?
I'll do that. Uh, chat background, show quest dialogue, John Trump, chat bubbles, chat, 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 chat. chat. No, we don't want a mature language. Really. Uh, enable display of local network play. Maybe that's that. Save. Need that. I don't know, just seems to be seems to stay there. Uh, that you looked up, Helen have him have an eternal war, Inarius and Lilith fall in love, escape and make sanctuary to live there, their children are powerful Nephilim. Uh, they are afraid that heaven and hell notices them, so they seal their powers until they become human. Bullshit happens with heaven and hell's attacking, Lilith gets banished, now Lilith comes back and wants to be mommy, but that means people go cray cray, Church of the Light don't like that. That's, okay, <clears throat> I love that, that uh, that's a good little uh, recap. So we have a battle between heaven and hell, a little bit of Romeo and Juliet uh, without all the underage stuff, and um, then demon mommy and church doesn't like demon mommy. Okay. Just throwing fire bolts, I love it. Just, it's reckless of them. How it should, should be. We have an Arctic bear. But I got him to get stuck on the corner because he's not very small. Oh, sorry, dear. I don't even get. Oh, I don't even get loot. Now I feel bad. We got a tunic. You've picked up an item. Wrong button. Okay. And so this is plus third plus nine. So yeah, equip. So yep, get rid of the sleeves. That makes sense when you're in the snow. Yeah, I don't know if uh, if you can turn it off. I'm, I may have to Google finger break. I mean, it doesn't bother me. I don't really look down in my corner, but it is kind of strange. What did I pick up there? Oops. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Skeletonian? How about you, Gohomian? Got a new... Some new things here. Hide gloves. Fancy gloves. <clears throat> so for the loot, uh, rule of thumb is uh, higher item power is better. Sometimes further on you'll want to focus on some modifiers, but it's honestly too much. Okay. That's good to know. The Latonian Archer. Oh! Ha! Dark Souls Dash. Like Bloodborne Dash. Pro Gamer. Maybe I should have gone with Hardcore. Healing Potions. Oh, okay, then. Let's just heal full. But that seems to. It seems incapable of making their hot female villains irredeemable, so I imagine she'll come good by the end. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> Maybe we marry her. See, all like just a beautiful romantic ceremony. There's so many healing potions. I'll take it. Turns into a dating sim three quarters through. Yeah, 
see that that is the next gen gaming that i want where like for like three quarters of the game you have whatever game you have and like every single game the last quarter in this new generation will just be a dating sim Go up here. Ooh! What's the loot? See all the loot loot? <clears throat> okay, so we pretty much... I feel like we explored this opening area pretty well, so I think it's time to head into this. Like a really really likes the gameplay of uh, Street Fighter, I hear. <clears throat> okay, I assume this is a dungeon, but luckily there are no dragons. Maybe this is just like a walking simulator, and there are no enemies, and I just have to have to use smart dialogue to get through this dungeon. Could be. I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it destroying these random things. I feel like so far, things that give me loot are like highlighted, like that one. So, but then again, I also just like. Loading stuff with my file buttons. Ooh, we got a skill point. We're so powerful. Uh, fireball pierces through burning enemies, or I could just make the fireball stronger right now. Oh, I can- oh, oh, there are also the number of skill points indicated. Can I- Ooh, okay. Oh, so these are mana costs. We got a fireball. I want a fireball. Can't learn that yet. Oh, I see. So that indicates I have to spend one more skill point and then I unlock this tree of skills. I get. Okay. The, yeah, I'm, I'm good with, uh, <clears throat> with enhancing the firebolt. Well, not. That's a stronger bolt. Alright. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's what I assume, Blacko. And from the get-go, I kind of was like, okay, this, this will be my pyromania. Probably go mostly fire base unless there's something that catches my eye where I'm like, ooh. And I don't know how it is with resistances, and you uh, don't have to tell me yet because I don't want to experience it myself. But um, I assume then there will there also will be enemies that have certain resistances, so maybe eventually get like a second element uh, going. At least just as a, as a as a backup might be worth it, but for now, in the beginning, I'll definitely stick with one, I think. You're, you're playing a Storm Druid? Okay, interesting. Yeah, I, I, uh, I was uh, interested in most of the... Like, the Druid didn't really interest me. Necromancer, I feel like a lot of people play uh, Hot Bone ma Magic. Ren confirmed that. and uh, But I also was thinking about doing Barbarian. So... Oh. Okay. There's a Boom Boom. Oh. Oh. All in. Why don't they stand up? Oh. Okay. It boomed them, so. 
that seem to have help. What's this? Healing well. I mean, there's a lot of healing in this opening dungeon. I appreciate, but I'm too much of a pro to need it. Oh boy, I might need it after this. Oh boy. Okay, we're still doing well. Barber's hot. You mean fun? Yeah. You like the gameplay? You established that. These skeletons are very unwelcoming, I have to say. They could. Skeleton captain. Come on. To the fire. The fire! Good fire lady. Soldier's hand wraps. I'll check it out in a second. Uh, oh, much better. Unlocks new look on salvage. What does that mean? Unlocks new look. I don't know. They look good, and they're strong. All I need. Oh. You'll leave me alone. Add Skeletonia. Add Skeletonia. Yep. Stronger. Salvage later. Okay, it's a thing that's... Alright. More healing. That's good. Oh, snowy skeleton. Oh, that's a big boy skeleton, I think. You with your snow can't do anything against my fire! Too fast. Too smart. Definitely too sexy. Another skill point. We are basically unstoppable, so now I get a fireball. Yes, of course I do. Okay. Got a fireball now, so everyone watch out. Echo got, got a fireball. We burn a death, we burn a this. Oh, I also got the, the gauntlets, right? Powerful gauntlets. Much stronger. Lots of strongness to it. Oh, another relic skull. I think we have... Is that the same? Oh, it's better. A plus seven damage per second. So I don't know exactly what that one does. Like that, that's a focus, I guess. One. Okay, let's just equip it. Seems better. Well, um, I think this might be a. Oh. There we go. I kind of had to learn first and see how I use it properly if I have to, like, <clears throat> choose an area or whatever. But I get it. I get it. Try it out. Man, these Diablo games, they're incredibly easy. Oh. Awesome gold there. No, I, I meant like I, I was just not sure what, like, what the skull item is. I guess it's a focus, like, you know, like, what, what that, 
equipment slot is for, I guess, is my point. Some heavy boots. I'm just talking out loud a little bit. So. You like me a good fireball. Big fan so far. Very hot. Oh, and this kind of circles around. All right. We are incredibly strong. Okay, I already used that. I shouldn't have done that earlier, but I think there was still um, healing potion that I didn't use. I don't know if they disappear after a while. That looks like it. Okay. I mean, we're almost full health. It's not that big of a deal. I just thought maybe I could pick it up. Okay. Oh, that is also good to Hell Touch Corridors. It's not a very pleasant name for a place in your home, but... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! That was a lot of them. I hear skittering. But you see what I'm hitting, but I'm definitely hitting it. Oh boy. You final ball out of here. Excuse me. He was raising them. Okay. Okay. I'm out of mana. You're out of mana. I'm out of patience. Just throw your fireball, lady. What I created you for. Don't give me the sass. Alright, Blacko. Make some food for the pupper. Thank you for stopping by. Hang out. At the least up. And tell me about Diablo lore. Ooh, you got pants. Pants. Better pants. Very nice. Fiery form. I'm the fire guy. And uh. Maybe I should have gone the other way. I, I just went to the left here. Let me just quickly go back. Because I feel like this is progression. It was just this crossing and I chose the path to the left. So. <clears throat> no. Something. Or pans. Oops. Are they any better? They are better. Put them on. Okay. It really was just the side room, but I uh, got better pans out of going back, so we'll take that as a win. Oh, we fought the fire, bro. 
Uh, this seems to be a side room, maybe. There we have another one of those blood pools, so let's go into the other direction. I assume that kind of indicates progress a little bit, so... Let's just go back here. What's here? Some loot? No loot? That's just rude. Actually worse than what I am. Even bother with them. Well, well, well. I hear snow. Uh decapitated priest. Oh boy. Oh boy. I need time to prepare that. Ouch. I lack the needed mana. I like the meat. Oh. Uh oh. Come back. Oh boy. I need time to prepare that. Spall. What a stupid name. I lack the need of mana. The one that gets so angry. Ouch. Let me alone, you Italians. I'm low on precious mana. You're low on precious mana. Oh boy. Ouch. Stop hitting me. I wonder that nobody is visiting you here. I'm not ready yet. Give me some healing. Put him on fire though, so. Considering that he's a creature of hell, it's bothering him more than I assume. I lack the needed mana. Like so much. There you go. I need oh. time. We're vulnerable! Kill them! 